And now, Sports Live. Last weekend, the Pocatello baseball team did something they haven't done in more than a decade, winning the 4A state championship. But for one of their players, that was just the icing on the cake, as he did something that many of us have never seen before. At the state track and field championships in Meridian, Pocatello sprinter Brody Birch crossed the finish line in first place in the 800 meter. An amazing accomplishment for any athlete, but Birch's day was just getting started as he was also a pitcher for the baseball team who was playing in the state title game on the same exact day. When we found out that state baseball was going to be in Twin Falls, um, it was looking like we were going to have a good shot at being in the state championship for baseball. and. Um, I wanted to run the 800 still, but try and make the state championship in baseball. And so um, we kind of were just talking and figured out that we could probably get a plane to fly back. And then my dad had some friends and he was talking with them and called in a few favors and got us a plane ride back to Twin Falls. And off Birch went, going up in the air, having to shift his focus from one sport to the next. It was hard to get over the feeling after winning the uh, 800. It was kind of it was such a, like a surreal moment like it was didn't feel real and then yeah once I was on the plane then started kind of turning into okay it's baseball mode. Birch arrived to their matchup against Skyview with the game already underway and he not only was there to support he was also ready to pitch striking out four and three innings of work on the mound playing a pivotal role in the Thunder State Championship win. Birch says playing two spring sports is no easy task and excelling in both requires dedication and support from his teammates. It definitely takes a lot of commitment, um, kind of a lot of like sacrifice in some parts, like I'd miss some baseball practices to get a good track workout in, uh, or missing like baseball games for a track meet or the other way around. And for Birch, his time with the Thunder had a storybook ending, but his journey is just beginning. I'm gonna go run at ISU next year, run track. Uh, I'm probably gonna do a signing, I think next week for that and then yeah that's my what my future is looking like right now. Birch says it's been a cool feeling to see the notoriety that a story has received and I could say I'm more impressed with him as a young man than as an athlete.